Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and it may be afternoon, morning, night, whatever it is for you. It's okay. I'm recording at nighttime, so that's why my intro has always been good evening, everyone. And if you didn't know that, oh, oh, oh well. Um, this is going to be either the last episode or the second to last episode of Undertale. This has been a very long series, very fun series, and I think the conclusion is, is just going to be amazing. Prepare yourselves for Undertale. Here we go. So we have everybody. Reset? No, 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 don't do the reset. We're going to continue on. All of our peeps are up here hanging out. Uh, oh, if you leave here, your adventure will really be over. No, no, no. Your friends will follow you out of the underground. Don't leave. Don't leave. Okay. We're not going to leave. I was told in the comments by you guys and by my son, don't leave yet. Go say goodbye to everyone. So we said goodbye to all these people, all of our friends, and we are going to head down the opposite direction. And if we go and look, uh, I believe all the coffins were open. So all, all the souls have been released, and we have a we have a different music now as well. So <clears throat> a very long adventure, a very very heartfelt adventure. If you guys didn't see the first one, or if you've not kept up with everything, oh, I guess I could have taken the elevator. Let's take the long way. We're gonna take the scenic route. I might take an hour to go through this entire thing. Who knows? Just to recap and show everything. If you've not been following along with the series, you really do need to go and start at episode one, because it's just, it's an amazing game by Toby Fox. <coughs> oh my gosh, such a long walk. I forgot how long we walked for. Oh, please tell me the, is the room unlocked? On. Okay, we already got the presents and stuff. It's a golden flower. Okay. Nope. Room still under renovations. Hmm. <clears throat> That's the best cuddles trophy. Despite everything, it's still you. <laughs> now, I saw a map of some kind that showed like a secret around here. Macaroni art. No, no, it wasn't in here. It was in the, the hotel. The uh, MMT resort. <clears throat> I don't think we're missing anybody in here. Okay. Nope. No one around. This is the new home. Oh, we don't need to save. Heading back. Going all the way back. Such a long walk. I probably should have taken the elevator. <laughs> That's okay. You'll you'll be here hanging out with me, talking about things. I really like the idea behind an RPG where you can choose not to fight. That, to me, is just a brilliant, brilliant idea. Because any other game that you tried to do that with, like, it, it'd be like, Yo, dead. <clears throat> the zero fatality moments. There shouldn't be any random encounters, either. So we're just heading on back. Um... Let's go ahead and take this down. I can't remember anybody up in that area. I think the MTT Resort is where it starts at. So let's go talk to this person. Sorry, we aren't allowing any more guests at this time. Or ever again. <gasps> Yay. Hey. Um, are you guys on your way out? Guess I'll catch up with you later. As a slime, I'm overjoyed. Good news, the elevator started working again, but now it's been so busy we still haven't gotten the chance to ride it. 
<laughs> oh, oh, forget this little guy. Sorry, the resort's shutting down, but I think you'll find it's still great <laughs> to pass through. It is. It is a great place to pass through. It is so strange. Knock, knock, knock. Room service never came. Sigh. Oh, oh, that's so sad. It's locked from the inside. Room service never came. Sigh. No response. Hey, buddy. Hey. Trying to finish up work. I just noticed he's going much faster. Oh, you don't have to sweep anymore, bud. It's all over. It's done. The underground's closing. Which is kind of sad. Like, how long has everybody been down here? Blub blub. Now we can live life without reservations. Yes, you can. So, if we're leaving, well, my job, um, and I just got a raise. Well, I guess every apple has its core. <laughs> oh, it was a core joke. Hey, buddy. The surface world. Really? Maybe I'll be able to go two feet without running into a puzzle. <laughs> I love that everything in reverse... Oh, what, what does this say? Hold on. It's a wall of fame full of quotes and from celebrities. The food is to die for. Gorgeous style. Fragrance. My face. It tastes the beautiful. All these from Metaton. Uh, does this say... In some kind of TV show, Met Metaton. Okay. Probably a rerun. Oh, we're all free? Oh, I guess I can stop licking this <laughs> ficus plant. But I don't want to look like I messed up, so I'll just keep going. Oh, buddy, it's okay. You, nobody's watching. You got like two people at the table. You can go. Thank you for the subscribe. Oh, it doesn't say who it was, though. Oh, my gosh. Hold on. Is there another one? Slay J. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Subscribing during the final moments of the, the Undertale series. Oh my gosh. Can can I? I didn't even try that the first time. <clears throat> Alright, we're out. Let's go say hi to these two. Caddy and Braddy. Hey, check it out. Let's just talk. Uh, so, like, what's up? I'm a human. Oh, oops, really? Uh, well, when we said, um, we were hyped for the destruction of humanity, we were just, like, joking. Did we say that? Probably. It's like, um, practically our catchphrase. Really? I thought our catchphrase was, Braddy's the best and Caddy's the coolest. Um, <laughs> no. We're like, literally never said that. <laughs> can I? Can it be though? Can it be? <clears throat> um, freedom. So we're like totally free now, huh? Yeah, like totally free. Like cool. Like yeah. Like cool. Like m millennia of being imprisoned finally over. Uh oh. Oh, got another subscriber. Gucci Big Chungus. Thank you for the subscribe. <laughs> Yeah, that's like pretty chill, I guess. Okay, so let's see the future. Hmm, now that we're going to be free? Oh my gosh, we can finally fulfill our dream of having a pet cat. That's like your dream, Caddy. But Braddy, I don't want to have a dream without you in it. Aw, Caddy. And in my dream, you clean up after the cat. Caddy! <laughs> Do you like cats? Me? Yeah, I love cats. Me? Yeah, I love cats. They're like, so tasty, cute. <laughs> Braddy, no. I'm just kidding. Kind of. Anyways, when was the last time you ever saw a cat around here? Oh, just the other day. There was this cute little white cat walking around. I was like, so clueless looking. I, uh, I pet it for like an hour. Caddy? Yeah, Braddy? I think that was like a dog. Dogs are just firm cats. <laughs> Alright, you two. You have fun. We're gonna we're gonna take off now. 
Is there any new things we could buy? No, nothing new. So let's get out of here. <sighs> like, see you later and stuff. Caddy and Braddy. No. We should, no, that's just a shortcut to get around to the, uh, the other place. All right, bud. What's your, I'm so excited to sell the ice cream to the surface. If all humans are like you, I think I'll be a modest success. That's true. Hey guys. Undyne told us that the Royal Guard is being disbanded. Like, bummer. Guess we'll have to go get used to love and peace. <laughs> he seems happy. He was, he's just content. He doesn't, it's okay that he didn't, you know. All right, defeated man. What? Do you want a rematch? <laughs> hmm. That's the okay. What's down here then? That's just the puzzle, and then where I fell into the puzzle, right? I think so. You probably could take screenshots of every area I've been in and make a full map of the place. Hello, hooray! Surface World will have so many new friends to help. Oh, I'm glad I came down here, buddy. We're only 11 minutes in. I probably could have cut out a bunch of stuff, but then you wouldn't get that full play playthrough, the full experience. Hello. Metaton, he recognized my voice when I called in and he gave me his dress. I'm so, <laughs> it's, it's awesome. <clears throat> Can we, hi, there she is. Bonjour, dearie. I just finished tallying up all of our donations. We've finally raised enough to rescue all the spiders inside the ruins. And we'll also be able to go to afford Four pairs of stylish heels for every spider! Congratulations! It's awesome. Oh, still walking through the through the webs. Oh wow. We could save it here. We're not going to. We're gonna keep going. Okay. Oh gosh. Um I guess I need, just need to go back this way. Where, where am I going? I don't even remember where I'm going. Maybe it's this way? Okay. Hello! On the surface, I won't buy any donuts from spiders. That's my resolution. Can I just grab these? It looks more like rubber than usual. It looks like some sort of powerful bracelet. Oh wait, it's just a croissant. What does it say? Spider bake sale, all proceeds go to real spiders. Are you guys still selling? Buy a donut for 999, or 9,999, no. How about this one? No. If I had time, that might be something fun to go and, go and do. But I, as soon as I go out of this game, oops, it's gonna be the true reset. So it's gonna, it's gonna reset everything. Please select a location. <clears throat> um, where are we at? We're on left three. Right floor three takes us to that guy that was defeated. Forgot his name. It wasn't like fire or flame drop or something like that. I don't remember. Okay. Hey, I wanted another hot dog, but the hot dog guy never came back. Besides that, today was fine. Count your blessings, even if you don't get a second hot dog. That is so true. Toasty bun. Who else did we need to meet? Hello, airplane? Aha, human, you're leaving. I have something to say to you. Admittedly, I may have had 
limerent feelings for you before. However, upon examining my own actions, I now realize I did not love you. I was merely infatuated with the concept of love, the idea of romance, the concept of sharing affection with another. Through these desires, I built a false concept of you in my head. Such a relationship would not have ended well. In closing, I believe it is better that I choose to say nothing. You, you idiot. <laughs> that was a very well thought out response from an airplane. Thank you. I appreciate that. Okay, we can't go that way. Can't we? Da, 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 da. I think this is just the uh, this is just the elevator, right? Okay, hold on. Uh huh. It's not that hard after you know the trick to it. Oh, the microwave. Seems like the mouse hacked the safe and took out the cheese. <laughs> so the mouse finally did it. I I knew you would. You little you little Dickens, crazy mouse. Determination, knowing that someday the mouse will hack into that safe and steal the cheese, which he did. <laughs> Wonder if any humans would want to be my friends. Psych! That'd never happen. I'll be your friend. <gasps> Snap! I was worried about these being steam traps last time, wasn't I? Alright, and then this is this is where the Metaton battle was going on, wasn't it? Look, no lasers. Oh, it's so wonderful. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, wait. What's... What was over that other direction? Oh, that's the, that's the like, part of the elevator, but not the actual elevator itself. Hmm. I'm getting a lot of messages. I wonder if people see that I'm playing Undertale and they're like, Oh my gosh, you're playing the last one! Hold on. I gotta check it. Gotta check it. Because it could be my wife sending me messages. There we go. Oh, I uh, need to... Okay, I'll, I'll have to do that afterwards. <clears throat> but yes, I will. Somebody called just before the recording. One of my like best friends growing up. and I feel bad when I don't answer him back immediately. But I've got to get used to the fact that like it's my record time. I'm recording now. I've got to record. It's for you. <clears throat> so we went to right two. And we're now on left two. So let's go to right floor one. And we'll walk our way back over through right floor two. Um, left floor one. <clears throat> I think. Maybe. <coughs> There's the core. So many save sparks. Oh, can we go back this way? It's glued to the table. Oh. I don't, I don't know that we can go all the way back this way. Yep. We are stuck on this side. Just so you know, we are 18 minutes into the video, and I feel great about it. Like this is a this is a really good feeling. Oh. It feels good to complete a video game. It f has a, a feeling of accomplishment, of determination. No pun intended for the determination of the game, but it just it feels good. Alfie's not here, is she? Hello, me again. Don't need to take anything with us. Nothing in there. Can't go in the true lab. We've been through here. I already know what's on the back side of this. Which is weird because, like, that lion showed up. What was the lion all about? That was the caller from the game. I understand, but... Is this just the elevator? 
There's no little lava. Oh, freedoms. Feels so spicy. <laughs> it is spicy. It's a spicy freedoms. Is this just the elevator? I think this is just the elevator. Can't go that way. Yeah, this is where we were introduced to the, uh, the jumps and stuff. Hey, buddy. <laughs> if we leave, no one will really ever know. The lava's so spicy now. I didn't even notice a difference. I didn't even see, like, the conveyor belt still goes downward. wonder if there's a cheat I could do. Oops. Oh, well. If we leave, no one would ever know. If the game gets reset, they wouldn't know. Oh wow, that's a really sad thought. Because if we leave and the game resets, the memory is wiped and nobody will remember that we left. Hmm. Uh, was I supposed to go to the left and right? I think I was supposed to go to the left and right. Hold on. There's puzzles, right? Yeah, there we go. The barrier's open, so we don't have to go to work today. I mean, sure, we're free, but it's a l the little things, you know? Today, <laughs> we're all started... We all started as co-workers. Who knows what will be tomorrow? I don't have to defeat a game again. Hey, buddy. So we're all gonna go free? Does that mean I don't have to get to go? Does that mean I don't get to go to work? Everybody's so concerned about their work, they forgot how how freedom tastes, you know? Oops. That's actually really sad. Hey girls! <clears throat> hey, did you hear? The barrier's opened. Now school has to be cancelled, right? It's true. I can't go down there. There will be lots of places to loiter on the surface, I bet. There will be. They're called shopping malls. Go! Uh, which way was I going? I was going, I was going up, wasn't I? That door has to open. And then over here, to here, to here, and then that's where Metaton is. Okay, so we, we made a big circle. We are all the way back around. That's good. That's a good thing. Okay, so now we can just take the elevator back over to L1 and go backwards the way we can. Uh, left floor one. Here we go. By the way, this is a really long trip, so I figure we, we were probably going to take over an hour to do this. I figured. What are you, buddy? Hello? Okay, 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 okay. I'll be able to have a nice drink on the surface. Can I, can I get a... It's a water cooler. Take a cup of water? Yes. Can I give it to you? Okay. I guess I'll just take it with me. The cup of water returned to the water cooler. Oh. He's got snow on top of his roof in such a hot area. Okay. Two hot lands. What does this say? Welcome to hot lands. Hot land. Does it keep saying that? 
Does it, does it say it again if I keep staying here? I wonder if there's an Easter egg there where like, if I stand there for 30 minutes or something, it changes the message to like some secret code to get me in secret places. Oh, this was the Undyne battle. What are you? Hello, what's this? It's a box, presumably to be pushed. All right, can I push you? Are you happy? Grr. Who are you? Freedom? What? Bah! You, you're pulling my leg. No, ser seriously, dude. Grr. Who are you? Freedom? What? Bah! Okay, okay, yeah, we're good. Some people just don't listen. However, there is a prophecy. The angel, the one who has seen the surface. <gasps> Am I that angel? They will return and the underground will go empty. Hold on, can you do the whispers? You hear passing conversation. Sorry, it's just funny that my wish, that's my wish too. So these, promise wouldn't laugh at it. Okay. So these, these are all the same wishes as before. Same conversation and stuff. So, what about over here? I'm going to tell my parents about this, are you? Oh, that was the, the little kid as Undyne was dragging him off. Oh no. Do these stay lit now? I do not want to get stuck down here. Okay. It only, it only increases as I move, doesn't it? Okay. So we should be good. Without candles or magic to guide them home, the monsters use crystals to navigate. <clears throat> we get to go see Team Village. Teamy. Team. Hiyo. Hoi! Hoi! Team go to colleague now! There's a lot of people down there. This is this is gonna be fun. Alright. Let's talk to him. Whoa! Team here news! Very good! Whoa! Team here news! Very Oh, is that, is that the same one? Very good. Yep. Yeah. yeah, yeah! Teams can go free! A pleasing development, no? <laughs> you all, you're, you were always the odd one out. I just. Whoa! If team can go to on surface, can see lots of cute humans. Everyone goes free, but team. Team not leave. Team watch egg. Team will be happily family. Family. It's a hard boiled egg. Hoives! Hoives! Mushroom dance, mushroom dance, whatever could it mean? It symbolizes the unbridled happiness that governs. <clears throat> the government told me they are willing to transplant me outside. Why didn't you slime smile at me at my dance? It almost feels a little rude. Oh. She's waiting for someone to let her out. Oh, how do I let her out? Oh, now my entire my entire mission is going to be incomplete because I didn't get team out. What does this say? Statue of team. Very famous. Very. Yeah, yeah. I agree. Should check team shop. <clears> Hoi, <throat> welcome to team shop. Hoi, I'm Timmy. Hoi. I'm Timmy. About the Timmy armor. Timmy armor so good. 
any battle become a easy victories, but hmm, team think if you use armors, battles would be a challenge wouldn't wouldn't be a challenge anymore. But team have a solution. Team will offer a scholarships. If you lose a lot of battles, team will lower the price. So if you get to if you get to tough battle and feel frustrate, can buy team armor at last as last resort. But team armor is so good, promise to only buy if you really need it. Team history, yeah, yeah. Team got a degree in Tim Tim studies. Team <clears throat> can tell you all about team team's deep history about the shop. Yeah, yeah. Go to team shop. Okay, what can we buy? Can we buy a scholarship? Oh, there's another teamy armor. Hmm. Can we buy the cheap Tim Flakes and then sell them off at a higher price, I wonder? And here's another thing that I was thinking of. If we were selling things to team to get money to buy team a scholarship, does that mean team had the money to go get their scholarship in the first place? Oh no, no, no. I don't want to buy. Uh, X. There we go. Boy! Boy! <laughs> Boy! Okay. Let's get moving. <sighs> we are currently 30 minutes in, so if you have school or... Nah, everybody's on spring break, right? If you're in the U.S., you're on spring break right now. Or at least you should be, or you're making up some snow days. We've had a lot of snow recently, so... Ah, oh, what a good game. It's like a really long extended credits, by the way. All right, Mr. Tol Turtle, let's go talk. Fluffy buns, why? Okay, okay, I remember clearly now. It was a monthly address, okay. There was a monthly address at the castle and the queen was giving her part on current events. After finishing her update, she moved to pass the microphone to the king. However, she didn't realize the microphone was still in her hands when she said, your turn, Fluffy buns. Then the audience burst into laughter. Realizing what she had said, she started laughing too. After a few moments, the king held up his arms. The crowd, the crowd grew silent. He leaned forward to the microphone. Expression stern. Dear citizens, thank you for coming here today. I, King Fluffy Buns, and the rest is history. <laughs> is Asgore a goat? And goat? Actually, that reminds me. Toriel, uh, Toriel once wore a flower pattern moo moo. Folks kept ke saying nice moo moo to her, but she kept thinking they were calling her a cow. She never wore it again. That was a that was the question, right? Oh, right. Asgore. He's a real interesting type of monster. Strongest type of all. We call call them boss monsters. When they have an offspring, the sole power of the parent parents flows into the child, causing that child to grow as the parents age. But Asgore doesn't have a child, so he's been stuck at that same age. Probably will be forever. Huh? What if a child is human? What? Nah, that wouldn't work. If Asgore's your father, he'll definitely outlive you. Good to know. Uh, yeah, of course. Toriel was the queen and Asgore was the king. It was tragic when she left, since everyone knew she was really the brains behind the throne. But it was also just a teensy, teensy bit relieving, you know? Those were... Those two were really insufferable together. Nuzzling noses, being all cute and cuddly in public, embarrassing their children. 
they were so sweet it made me sick. <laughs> Thank gosh, those days are gone and over. What? Well, I, I knew you could do it. Wait. What What did I say? Wahaha! Well, ha, I knew you could do it. There we go. Okay. Talk. Undyne. Undyne? She really come a long way since she was a little urchin. I used to be a hero myself back in those days. Gerson the Hammer of Justice. When she was younger, Undyne would follow me around to watch me beat up bad guys. Sometimes she'd even try to help. Though most of the time, the folks she attacked weren't bad guys. I'd be... I'd... It'd be the mailman or something like that. Anywho, I appreciated it. Wah ha ha ha. Alright, we're gonna exit. Any new stuff to buy? Torn notebook, cloudy glasses, sea tea, and crab apple. Nothing new. Be careful out there, kid. Just so you guys know, getting back to, like, oh, we don't need to talk to him quite yet. Going backwards is going to be longer than going forwards, because I can, I can skip and use the thing. Snails! It's a snail. You wonder if Toriel has seen it. Snail, snail. You reached the end of your extensive journey. Snail, snail. What a long trip. Remember to stretch your muscles. The housing market will probably crash now. But you know, home is where the heart is. Using its money, the snail bought a hat. And can probably live in that hat. Oh! I forgot about the, the snail races. Oh, and the, the ghost is gone. We can't do a snail race anymore. Oh well. Times are times. In game. Metaton, what are you doing? There you are, Frisk. Uh, there you are, Frisk, darling. Feast your eyes on Dr. Alfie's com completed my wonderful new body. Oh, and did you hear? The barrier's open. I can't wait to see the sun. The greatest spotlight of all. Oh, yes, I'm supposed to start to think. I suppose I should thank you too, darling. Before fighting you, I had forgotten how fun it was to perform with others. So I've I've been searching for hot talent to fill up fill up my upcoming troop. Troopy. So far, Serene's agreed to be my backup singer. And the Napstelbluk Napstelbluk here will be my sound mixer. The three of us performing together. It really feels overdue, doesn't it? Wait, I thought this was... Fell down recently. It was sad. Her sister, speak of, becoming more reclusive than ever. We perform. I thought this was... Oh. Metaton. I'm a huge fan. Oh, hi. Human, I never forgot... Hold on. I'll never forget when you cheered me on. When I was pretending to sleep. No one had ever been so... Had so much faith in my fake sleep. Uh, also, this is awkward, but... What's your name? Everyone seems to know it, except me. It seems like you've... I've been missing out lately. I was just sitting at home listening to tunes, and there was a flash of light outside my window. I saw the snails on the farm disappear. I heard a knock at the door. Flash of light wanted to come in. I closed the blinds. Now everyone knows your name except for me. Frisk? Okay, I won't forget it. I don't see a window. Oh, he's got a window behind his uh, computer. Hmm. So, you helped us all free. 
I guess I really acted like a dummy to you. Sounds like only fire lives here now. Poor Undyne's house. That was my fault. I mean, I did that. The Duck of Determination? Or should we go back the other direction? Is there peeps down here? I don't remember. There was the battle. This is just the garbage, right? The waterfall and the garbage. There shouldn't be anyone down. <gasps> hey! What are you doing here? Hold on. Hey, buddy. Don't drag your dirty feet in here. I just cleaned this trash. Right, you're the cleaning ducky thingy. Got it. I'll stay in the water. I'm sorry. Oh, 41 minutes. Yeah, it's gonna be a gonna be a two-parter. <laughs> I might stretch this out for three episodes. Who knows? No, I don't want. To, I don't want to stretch it out for longer than I have to. So, if this is going to be it, I might as well just keep going until the very end. All right, duck of determination. Little bird wants to carry you guys. Accept the bird's offer. Get a ride. Come on, buddy. Flap your little wings. Flap them. Flap them. Good job. Go, little buddy. <laughs> Poor little guy. <laughs> you okay? You okay? Oh. Good duck. Mm -hmm. Now, can I go down through here? Oh, let's go talk to this guy just real quick. <coughs> we can go and see the real stars now. But I still don't know what those are. I don't think there was anything down through here. Maybe. I can't remember. pair of ballet slippers. Will you take it? Yeah. <gasps> the ballet slippers from one of the uh, children from before. It was the, the ribbon, or the... No, it was the... The tutu and the ballet slippers. That's really sad. You hear a passing conversation. Don't say that. Come on. I promise I won't laugh. Okay. This is this is the long way around to get back up to the thing, right? Hi there. Can we, can we talk? Can we talk? We can't talk. Okay, let's go to the end. Hi. Did you hear? Uh, did you hear? You're back. <clears throat> I'll tell you a big secret. I'm starting a band, you hear? It's called the Red Hot Chilby Peppers. Red Hot Chilly Peppers, funny. All I've thought all I've thought of is the name. And I don't play instruments or sing. Well, do you think we'll be popular? Yeah. Me too. Can can we talk anymore? Or is that it? I think that's it. All right, good luck. Bye. What in the world? Can I talk to you? It's good, it's good, it's good. Uh, it's good to be, whoa, what? It's good to be with my sister again. It's good to be with my sister again. Part of me wants to see my brother, Aaron. Part of me wants to see my brother, Aaron. But most other parts of me don't. It's good to be with my sister again. I can't. 
I can't talk to you though. What's this way? The power has anything to kind of uh, monster dies. Soul disappear. Incredible power. Okay, we've we've read these. We've read these. Come on. What's up here? Isn't this like the ultimate power thing again? The orb? Yeah, it's gone. The artifact is gone. I wonder where he took the artifact. Can can we play? Yes. Piano here. Play it. Yes. Okay. Oh, it was telling me X to quit. <laughs> I feel like there's more hidden secrets on that piano. Just saying. it continues and doesn't stop. It doesn't show us the secret anymore though. Please take one. Alright. Take an umbrella? Yeah, let's take one. You took an umbrella. I wonder what happens if we don't have an umbrella. I don't know. I've never not taken one. I mean, they're courtesy umbrellas, right? Somebody's got to walk all of them back at the end of the day, after people walk through here. Why is it only raining on the path? Seriously? Like that flower's not getting any water on it. All right. Oh, <laughs> I was like, what is that? Oh, that I forgot how pretty this is. Hey, buddy! You came all this way to see me flex? It really says something about you. Return the umbrella? Yeah, let's put it back. You return the umbrella. Oh no! Oh no, I can't get up that direction! Oh, that's why you were so proud. Okay. Came all this way to see him flex. Yes! Alright. Gonna walk all the way back. That's gonna take some time. Good thing I don't edit, right? <laughs> if you're still here and you're still watching and I haven't edited yet, thank you. Thank you for spending the time with me. I really do appreciate it. I feel like watching these videos, watching the full length of them, it gives me a sense of determination. It feels, <laughs> sorry. Fills me with determination. Ha ha ha, Code, you're so funny as I sit here and eat my snack watching your game play. <laughs> and if you were eating the snack and you just choked on it because I said something, I'm sorry. I apologize. <clears throat> mm. oh, we're gonna have to walk all the way back because I have not been saving it anywhere. But it's good to see see everything in reverse. Does this person come back? Or is it only at the beginning? Hi! <laughs> Since it... Oh! This is something new. How would I ever know? Well, I'll keep my tentacles out for you. You hear? As soon as I know, we'll be the first to tell you. Here? Aww. If nobody had come back and told them, hey dude, you're free. I don't know that they would have known. It just would have been an empty underground and they would have been here forever. That was sad. Hmm. I bet Snowden's gonna be popping with everybody. That's where we're heading to next, right? These are the cave areas. I don't even know what this is called. <clears throat> Alright, what's here? What's this? Anybody want to tell me what the mushrooms do? If anything? Box for storing... Uh, store, it's a box for storing punch cards. It's empty right now. Oh. 
No punch cards, no work today. It's an odd looking telescope. I can't look through it. <sighs> it seems like the mouse has freed some of the cheese from the crystals somehow. You sneaky little mouse. Squeak. What are you? Three gold for the fairy. Yes or no? Yes. Hop on. Thanks for stepping on my face. Here's three, the three gold. You got three gold. Wait, what? Oh, okay. The surface intimidates me. The entire outer layer of the earth is made of dirt. It's true. It's very true. Hope I didn't miss anybody back there. Uh, okay. Sorry, my fear of incompletion doesn't allow me to do this without checking. All right. Thanks for stepping on my face. Here's three gold. Am I getting three gold every time? Four ninety-five. I'll check when I get back. Yeah, I think this is just a just a dead end, isn't it? Nope. This is the Battle of Undyne. The start of the Battle of Undyne. <sighs> Please tell me it doesn't, like, I don't get stuck. Oh, that's going to be a long walk. Toby um, Fox, the creator of the game, he made it so you didn't have to do this kind of stuff, like going back. And that's because he, he admittedly, he stated he hates going backwards in games like um, one of the worst games that I ever played that I had to go backwards on was Metal Gear Solid it was for the PlayStation 2 and you get almost up to the very end and there's a sniper wolf her name was sniper wolf or something wolf and she was you could only kill her with a sniper it was a sniper battle and you had to go all the way back to like the second stage just to get the the sniper rifle. Hop on. Alright, so 495. Thanks for stepping on my face. Here's three gold. 498. So literally paying us money to step on their face. Ah, seems like a horoscope was last week. Okay, can we look through this one? Look through the telescope, yes. Check wall. Check wall. Check what wall? Check wall? Check wall. I guess we've already done. <laughs> oh, the bridge is already built. But, I was told to try something. it take the quiche you're carrying too much you aren't ready for the responsibility uh, can can we eat something do we have something to eat dream comes true your HP was maxed out I'll take the quiche why not yeah let's not leave the quiche behind what else just a bench I just wasn't ready for the responsibility. 
of the quiche. I think that's an Easter egg reference. Or at least that's what it said on the wiki. Hopefully that's true. <laughs> oh, 55 minutes. And we've not even made it to Snowden yet. Oh gosh. Is there any other way to use those flowers to gain access to something? Probably not. I gotta turn my heater down just a little bit. Ooh, um, I'm just gonna go for it, why not? The mushrooms have gotta be for something, right? And this is where we first encountered the box. Sincerely a box hater. What? Something behind the rushing water. Okay. I know guys, I know. It's it's a long walk. But I think it will be worth it. Is that a door to somewhere? I hope it'll be worth it in the end. What does it say? What well, gives life validation except the Akin flower? No one can know. Alright. Never trust a flower. That's one of the constraints of this world. Constance. Con Constance. That's one of the constants of this world. <laughs> Do you say something else? No. That's it. Flowey was a flower. Okay, right here's where the icebergs usually float in, right? So we're almost back to Snowden. Yay! Can we... Is there anything... Oh my gosh. <clears throat> okay, what's in here? It's locked from the inside, okay. Their house is still... Empty. This thing's so tall that you couldn't even wash your hands. What's in this back door? Look in the closet. Clothes hang up neatly inside. Bookshelves, complications, children's books. Can I go inside here? The door's locked. We'll probably just leave it. <laughs> the rock is covered in sprinkles. Okay, so there's still a secret entrance back here, locked, that we're not going to be able to get to. It's a mailbox labeled Papyrus. Look inside? Yes. It's empty. It's a mailbox overflowing with unread junk mail. Here we go. Having an amorphous, amorphous, shambling, shambling family member is great. They're always moving, so I can see them 100% of the time. Aww. All of our parents have been combined into one horrible being. That's okay, though. It's really brought our family together. Aww. Wait, what? Are you supposed to do something? Oh. They're talking to each other. Oh, Okay. Hmm, now that our parents are the same entity, does that mean I've, I'm married to my sister? Wait. We're dogs. That stuff's normal. <laughs> Whoa. <clears throat> That's not Alfie's, right? Welcome to the library. This is the last day that will be open, so make it as much noise as you want. <laughs> oh my, there's so much news to report. I don't know where to begin. How about the headlines? Monsters go free from the underground. No, that doesn't have enough pizzazz. How about top ten monsters that you won't believe got freed from the underground? 
whatever clickbait you want to use, go for it. This will be our newspaper's last issue. Why don't we just uh, put a bit the end on the front page and call it a day? <laughs> Mike Wazowski! <laughs> the greatest struggle of my life is over. I just solved today's junior jumble. Wow. Wow. All right, let's keep going. Oh, we're free? Finally. I've been able to stop smiling. Wait. I'll be able to stop smiling. Oh, don't stop smiling. Because, I mean, just because you're freed. Hello. Now we can play monsters and humans with real humans. Hmm. When humans play monsters and humans, do they call it humans and humans? Seems like this is the beginning of a brand new boundless world. Waha. This adventurous spirit. I'm like a kid again. And my children are like... Double children. Ah, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, they'll hear it. I'll hear it again. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Sorry. Sorry guys, sorry. One million subscribers. Oh gosh. What what what? what? Okay, I'm good. I'm good. Uh, hold on. I'll knock again. Ah, my patience rewards me. Ah. 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 Come on. It's it's freedom time. Let's go. <sighs> you really need a doorbell, okay? Because freedom rings. <laughs> Sorry. That was... Hey, buddy. Ice Wolf no longer has to throw ice. Ice Wolf can take a break and buy some pants now. I didn't even notice you don't have any pants on, sir. Uh, Ice Wolf was thinking of changing their name to Jimmy Hot Pants. <laughs> Get some pants first, buddy. All right, don't need to go on the ride because we're, we're taking the long way around. Oh gosh, looks like I don't have to worry about cracking jokes anymore. I was going to say a joke here, but I really don't have one. Oh my gosh, just got another subscriber. Who was it? Who was it? Oh, I missed it. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, poop. Grills, grill bees, grills bees. I heard Dr. Alfie has told the king and queen the awful things King and Queen, the awful things she's done. The King felt so bad that he didn't know. He gave her a big hug. And then the Queen fired her. And now we don't have a royal scientist anymore. That's politics. What? The Queen fired her? Good job. Thanks, Grillsby. Always a simple man, simple taste. Wow, brand new world. It might get trans... I might not get to translate for Grillsby anymore. Which is fine, since <clears throat> I was actually just making up what he says. <laughs> In the end, I never caught up any girls on my fishing line. So, kid, take it from me. Don't try to catch hot people with a fishing rod. Somewhere you hear a whining of dismay. Finally won a game of poker against itself. Hold on, can I? There you go. Soon I'll be able to try human food. And then I guess I'll try human bathroom too. I wonder if the overworld has hot guys. And neat drinks. Ooh, I'm ready. Hey, people won't have to move in from the city anymore. Seems like we won't have to lose our local culture. Except we're all moving out of here, huh? Oh well, guess it can't be an all punk peaches and punk cream? I guess it all can't be punk peaches and punk cream. Peaches, it can't all be peaches and cream. 
Got it. Okay. Jukebox is broken. It's still broken after all these years. And I still got a mouse in the way. I'm sorry. There we go. We're so close, guys. So close. Hang with me. Hang with me. I know, I know it's been a long journey. Yo, what's up? I've been kind of doing some thinking. Maybe Undyne isn't actually as cool as we thought. She's just kind of mean. But yo, I just found out about someone way cooler. Nah. <laughs> it's carefully decorated tree. Some of the presents are addressed from Santa to various locals. It'll be nice to show humans our presents under the tree tradition. <laughs> They'll probably be weirded out by it. <laughs> that kid over there told me it's weird that I have a pet bunny. First, there's nothing weird about it. It's cute. Second, what? It's normal to walk your younger brother on a leash, right? Oh, it's your brother. Okay, halt. FBI, open up. <laughs> Poor kid. Get your brother off a leash. Uh, is anyone else worried about by those giant shambling amalgamates or no I had to fight him so I mean I'm, I'm not worried out by him they're kind of cool I think hello sorry no time for a nap Snowden is shutting down so we can all go to the surface mom says that we can go to the surface world now what's so great about that anyway I don't want to move <laughs> poor thing Hello, Traveler. How can I help you? Let's talk. Uh, care to chat? What happened? I mean, it happened to you, right? There was a strange flash of white light. Then I felt my body being pulled into something. Then suddenly, everything was back to normal. Human. I heard it was all because a human came through here. A human? I can hardly believe it. Well, if... When they decide to stop in, I'll be sure to give them a hero's welcome. Did you hear? The ruins have been opened up. And get this, they were opened from the inside. Apparently the queen had been staying inside there for gosh knows how long. Pretty unbelievable, huh? Well, I suppose I'll move my store to the overworld. Haven't planned much more than that, I'm afraid. Take your time. Okay, Did, we got all of that. Okay, we're good. We're good. Bye now. Come again sometime. I don't remember if I had accents for any of the other people, but if I did, I'm sorry that I'm not using them now. And if you're still sticking with me at one hour and eight minutes, or if you came back, I mean, you could have paused it and came back if you wanted to. That's cool too. I don't mind. Um,. I don't expect you guys to watch this in one sitting, but if you do, I mean, that's cool. Hello? Oh, you got your little hat back. Maybe someone on the surface will pay attention to me. There's so many people, someone has to, right? Oh yeah, there'll be people up here. What's this? Woof. It must be bigger on the inside. All right, we don't have to check all the puffs again. It's down here. Hey, buddy. How are you? Everyone's leaving, eh? Good riddance. Maybe I'll finally get some peace and quiet. I know people, they decorated your horns and everything. Poor thing. Hope those spider eyes come out. You guys are free now. Now, isn't... Oh, ooh. This is that door, right? It's a door. This is the secret Toby thing, isn't it? If I just don't move, doesn't it do something? Isn't it like a special counter after 30 seconds? I almost, I don't wanna stick around here. It might be like 30 minutes or something. Anyhow, behind that door is supposed to be uh, a dog who is supposed to be like the creator of the game, Toby, who created the whole thing in his sleep or something. I don't remember the, the details. 
Anyhow, you can look that up on the wiki. If this doesn't happen in a couple seconds, I'm gonna leave. I've gotta go. I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go. That's gonna be it. Mm. Okay, we're gonna go. Sorry. Can't hang around here all day. <laughs> Some of you are like, why not, Heath? I mean, you were here that long. There's a little house down there. And it's got lights on, and there's smoke coming out at the top, so you know somebody lives there, right? I just wonder who it is. <sighs> Alright, let's go back through this direction. Can we go any other direction? No, no, stop, stop, stop. <sighs> Alright, go back the other way. I guess it doesn't matter, does it? Hey, what you doing? We're all free? Okay, okay. I'll stop l lounging around. Does that dog know? It probably doesn't, doesn't it? Oh, look. He was starting to, to build... It looks like the base of a snow dog. He was starting to build it up. Uh, the floor inside of... Oh, bleh, bleh. On the floor is inside is a box of pomeranians. Pomeran pomeranians. What? I don't know what that means. <clears throat> Aware of dog. Please pet dog. Not beware of dog. Aware of dog. All right. No spikes. Good. Can I just walk through here? Yeah, we're fine. Hey, buddy! Hey, <laughs> I guess I'll have to go to the surface. There's, there are woods we can live in, right? Oh yeah, you'll be, you'll be fine. People will probably misunderstand you at first, understand you, but as long as you stick with it, show them that you're not afraid, you'll be fine. Is there anything new to this awesomeness? I'm delaying the inevitable that this is the end, and that I'm not going to be able to play this anymore. I mean, that's pretty much why. Hey, ha! After all this time, you're still thinking about my hat. Please? <laughs> I will think about your hat. From time to time, as I travel through my years of playing video games, I will come back and think, hmm, do you remember that battle with that guy that had that hat on? The ice hat? <gasps> spaghetti! It's a plate of lukewarm spaghetti. Seems like something tried eating it just gave up. It's an unplugged microwave. All of its settings say spaghetti. It's a note from Papyrus. Seeing as this spaghetti is still here somehow, I hereby donate it to the public. It's like a playground for your mouth. Nay, <laughs> papyrus. Well, wow. where's the cheese? Did did the did the mouse get the cheese? I will assume that that bite from was. Oh wait, monster for kit. Uh, should we try and do this? I see robot on the far right hand side. We're not we're not gonna do this right now. If you want to take a screenshot right now. Um, you know, and complete this later on. Go for it. But I'm good. Oh, by the way, there, uh, this little flag will actually pop up and give you different colors for what placement you got. However fast you got it down there. What's over here? Oh, okay. His. Hers. Smell danger rating. Snow smell, snowman, white rating can become yellow rating. Unsuspicious smell, puppy blue rating smell rolling around. Weird smell, humans green rating destroy at all cost. Sorry, forgot to talk to you, buddy. I'm worried about getting older. I'll stop being a teen. No, I refuse. 
I'll just have to invent new numbers like 20 teen. That's okay. I'm 2037 teen. <laughs> 3017. That's what I am. 3017. Alright. Hey, buddy. Ah, I can feel that piece of me has been well taken care of. Hmm? The barrier's open. Hmm. Then, if it's not too much to ask, can I take that piece of me to the surface? Oh, could you take that piece of me to the surface? I'd really appreciate it. Sure. Um... It might melt once we get up there, but I'll take I'll take it up there with me. Hmm. North is ice, south is ice, west is ice, east is snowed in and ice. Oh my gosh! An hour and fifteen minutes just to walk backwards through this whole thing. A note was written here, very oddly, as if the paper was moving while it was writing. It says out to lunch. Absolutely no moving. There's some narration on the cardboard box. You observe the well-crafted century station. It's just cardboard box. Who could have built this? You ponder. I bet it was that famous royal guardsman. Not, not yet a famous royal guardsman. Update. I am. Am I a royal guardsman yet? Seeing as it's been disbanded, the doctor, the Daka. The doctor. She brought my wife back from the dead. My son, he seems happy again. Our family, it's bigger, bigger than ever. Ever. Now that, now that my wife is combined with my six, with 16 other people. Mom might have to share her mind with other people now, but she's still my mom. And that's cool. Because uh, we're made of ice and stuff. What? It's a joke. Laugh at it. <laughs> Snowy. I remember fighting you. Aww. <laughs> Gonna cry. <clears throat> Not really, but. It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Reel it in? Yes. It's attached. Uh, there's a note attached to the end. Never mind, guys. <laughs> We're almost to the very beginning. <gasps> Do you guys remember this? We like hid behind it. Can we? Can we hide behind it again? Can't even get close to it. Just a conveniently shaped plant. Seems like a checkpoint for centuries, but there are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. Gosh. Do you guys remember episode two? Episode one or two? Wow. I guess that was a really long walk the first time, wasn't it? Especially with like um, Sands following after us as a shadowy shadow. There's a camera hidden inside the bushes. Here we are. We're back. Oh, wow. Is this the room? No, this is home, isn't it? We're in the basement of the, the first home. Oh my gosh. Oh, wait, I completely forgot. Noticed you received a text from Toriel. Dear Frisk, Sans and Alfie's are teaching me how to text. I'm learning so much. For example, do you know what a smiley is? Please look at this. <laughs> now, turn your head to the left. And it's a picture of me smiling at you. Can you see it? LOL. That stands for lots of laughter. Sincerely, Tutorial. That's all for now. Maybe in the next room you will receive another. Toriel sent you a message. Dear Frisk, how are you? You have been wandering around for quite some time now. I hope you aren't getting into trouble. Only kidding. Lol. Sincerely, Toriel. P.S. 
Do not get into trouble. <laughs> did she send you a text into every single one and I've been through all these different rooms? Excuse me. I did not mean to write sincerely. I meant to say sincerely. Wait, did you misspell it? It's, it is difficult to use this with large hands. Perhaps I should ask Sans to transcribe for me. He's not sending new messages. She has been sending messages in every room, hasn't she? Sans will be typing from now on. Uh, sorry, I, I'm not gonna restart the, the whole thing. An hour and 20 minutes just to go back to see all the text. Hey Frisk, it's Toriel just baked uh, on a million pies. <laughs> Do you want any? Make sure you brush your teeth before crossing the street, Frisk. Okay, Sans. <laughs> brush your teeth before crossing the street. Toriel sent you a message. I did not say any of that. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, first room should be open. Should look like a kid's room. This is Azriel's room. Former room. I think this is the room that I woke up in. No, this is Toriel's room. This room is under renovation. Room under renovations. Still just you, Frisk. It said my name. So if you name your character Frisk when you first start, it, the, all the battles, I guess, become like 100% harder. So unless you want a really hard battle to go through, don't name yourself Frisk. <sighs> Hello, tree. Every time the old tree grows a leaf, they fall right off. Poor tree. Can we go this way? We gotta go tell the uh, spiders, right? Hey, frog. Ribbit, ribbit. Seems like the ruins have finally opened up. Maybe we should finally go outside, uh, out to the rest of the underground. Huh? The barrier's open too? Let's just take this one step at a time, okay? Alright, if you want to. Look at how glorious the city looks. Now, by the way, I didn't see any of these towns while I was out there. Just saying. Like, where's the city? I mean, I, I didn't even find a door to get to a city of some kind. Are there people? What was that? Okay. That's okay. We can go back. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Wasn't there, like, a, a guy down here? No. There's nobody down here. Okay. Let's try not that one. I think we're just wasting time. Let's check the middle. Okay. Doesn't look like there's anybody down here, so let's not worry about it. Alright. I know that there's at least some frogs and a rock I need to talk to. Ribbit, ribbit. Yellow names were nice for a while. Next time we should try relaxing shade of green. Cool. Ribbit, ribbit, did you ever find this room's fourth frog? Ribbit, ribbit, say, now that your journey is over, maybe you'll have time to listen to me. Since most people just press X to skip through my dialogue. That's right, pressing X. I suppose some, some things never change. Oh, okay. haven't you oh it's a different thing do you see that if you press X during the dialogue it says some things never change and then if you don't press X it's like you've really matured haven't you all right somebody told me that the fourth frog is like up in the wall is that right there's an ant sized frog in the crack in the wall it waves at you there's an ant sized frog in the crack of the wall I don't even see anything up there. 
Okay, so I found the other frog. Ribbit, ribbit. Did you ever find this room's fourth frog? I did. Hold on one second. Alright, I'm back. <sighs> we are just about finished. Spider bake sales. Big sales. Are they still selling? Uh, yeah. Oh, carrying too many items. Okay, fine. Carrying too many items. Um, hold on. Can I just... Yeah, we're not going to worry about it. We're good. We're good. We're heading heading back to the beginning. Looks like the cheese has been has a nibble taken out of it. <gasps> you little thingy. I am filled with determination. The exit's open. I guess I better roll out. Hey, you mind giving me a push, pumpkin? Sure. Exit's open. Uh Stop, 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 stop. Okay, okay. Can I push you from this side? Okay, you just you just say the same dialogue over and over again, don't you? Okay. These don't say anything. We're good. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> there we go. Okay. I think that's it. There's there was nobody else, was there? Oh wait, there is. Uh the training dummy at the beginning, right? Oh. Ribbit ribbit. Excuse me, human. You seem like you've grown into a thoughtful and cons consensuous con person. Whether that was from my advice or not, I'm quite proud. Ribbit. Thank you. Take one. Take a candy? Yes. You're trying to take a piece of candy, but you didn't have any room. All right. Um, let's go to a cell phone, dimensional box. Let's put some of our dreams away. Keep your dreams in a box. Take one. Take another piece of food. Feel like the scum of the earth. Take one? Yes. You took too much too fast. The candy spills onto the floor. No! Oh no, can we pick it up off the floor? Look what you've done. It makes you feel so bad about taking a piece of candy. A couple of pieces of candy. Oh. Alright, let's go back to the dummy. I, I was told, I told my son I would do the whole thing. We're gonna go for the whole backlog, and then I'm just going to sprint for the exit. I'm glad he told me to go back. Like, go talk to everyone. Oh, Toriel's text messages. Toriel sent you a text message. Greetings, this is Sands. I love my brother very much. Help, I'm being slandered. Oh, I can't actually step on the spikes. It just stops me. Well, that's useful. Hey! Can I talk to you, buddy? Cannot talk to you. Okay. I'm gonna hit that button. I'm gonna hit this one, too. Switch doesn't even work. <laughs> that one's already pulled. What does it say? Press Z to read signs. Or enter. Either way. I still remember the pattern. Flowey. Remember our first encounter? Hey! Wait! Golden flowers. They must have broken your fall. Don't worry about me. Someone has taken care of these flowers. Someone has...
has to take care of these flowers. The golden flowers, they must have broken your fall. The golden flowers must have broken your fall. Okay. So I'm going to spoil it for you. So if you don't want to know the spoiler, uh, turn down your sound right now. And when I come back, I'm, I'll make an X with my hands. That, that means I'm done with the spoiler. So get ready. I was told inside the wiki that the bodies of the first children, or the body of Azrael, the, the child, the, hum, the first human child, which is like Code, because I'm Frisk. Code is, is buried under there, the first to fall. That's what I was told. And that's why Azrael has come back here to take care of the flowers. Frisk, please leave me alone. I can't come back. I just can't, okay? Said something else. I don't want to break their hearts all over again. It's better if they never see me. Why are you still here? Are you trying to keep me company? Frisk. Hey. Let me ask you a question. Sorry, I forgot to tell you guys to unmute. Why did you come here? Everyone knows the legend, right? Travelers who climbed the Mount Ebbet are said to disappear. Frisk, why did you ever climb the mountain like that? It was, was it foolishness? No, it was an awesome download of a video game that I wanted. <clears throat> was it fate? Or was it because you, well, only you know the answer, don't you? It's because it was a good Steam game had lots of reviews. I know why Code climbed the mountain. I w it wasn't for a reason. It wasn't for a very happy reason. <coughs> Frisk, I'll be honest with you. Code hated humanity. Why they did, they never... Why they did, they never talked about it. Uh, why they did, they never talked about it. But they felt very strongly about that. Frisk, you really are different from Code. In fact, though you have similar uh, fashion choices, I don't know why I ever acted like that. Hold on a second. I'm turning off my phone. I don't know why I ever acted like like you were the same person. I don't know why I ever acted like you were the same person. Maybe the truth is, Code wasn't really the greatest person. While Frisk, you're the type of friend I wish I had always had. So maybe I was kind of projecting a little bit. Let's be honest, I did some weird stuff as a flower. There's one last thing I feel like you should tell, like I should tell you. Frisk, when Code and I climbed, uh, combined our souls together, the control over our body was actually split between us. They were the one, they were the one that picked up their own empty body. They were the one that picked up their own empty body. And then, when we got to the village, they were the ones that wanted to use our full power. I was the one that resisted. And then, because of me, we, well, that's why I ended up as a flower. Frisk, this whole time I've blamed myself for, the dis for that decision. That's why I adopted the horrible view of the world. Kill or be killed. But now, after meeting you, Frisk, I don't regret that decision anymore. I did the right thing. If I'd killed those humans, we would have had to wage war against all of humanity. And in the end, everyone went free, right? I still feel kind of sad knowing how long it took. So maybe it wasn't a perfect decision. But you can't regret hard choices your whole life, right? Well, not that I 
have too much of a life left. But that's besides the point. Frisk, thank you for lis thank you for listening to me. You should really go be with your friends now, okay? Oh, and please, in the future, if you uh, see me, don't think of it as me, okay? I just want you to remember me like this. Someone that was your friend for a little while. Oh, and Frisk, be careful in the outside world, okay? Despite what everyone thinks, it's not as nice as it is in here. There's a lot of flowies out there. And not everything can be resolved just by just by being nice. Frisk, don't kill. And don't be killed. Alright? That's the best you can strive for. Well, I'll see ya. Frisk, don't you have anything better to do? Yes. Frisk, don't you have anything better to do? Yeah, I mean, my wife just came to me and said, Hey, we need to put the kids to bed. I need to go put the kids to bed. But I told her that I was still recording. And then I, I got a phone call from my best friend, David. One of my best friends. Not like my bestest friend, but like best friends. I think that's it. I think we're just going to start repeating. That's it. Yep, yep, yep. yep. That's that's a repeat. Can, can, these are just repeats as well. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. The entirety of the true pacifist round completion, whatever you want to call it, the game is is done. We are at one hour and thirty six minutes. I hope you're okay with this. I hope it's been a, a pleasant journey, and I should probably break this up into two episodes. I'm not going to. <laughs> I'm going to keep it the same length as I played it and hopefully somebody else enjoys it as much as I did if you've stuck around this long if it even gets views <laughs> it's probably just going to have like 136 views and that's it that's all it's ever going to see but for you 136 for you one viewer for you one person that stuck around and watched the whole thing thank you thanks for chilling out with me thanks for grabbing popcorn thanks for just being you I feel like a better person after playing this, honestly. And I, I probably I will never go for the genocide route. I take that back. If I ever retire, <laughs> and you know I've got some time on my hands and we're traveling, I might play this to uh, the genocide route. But you know that's going to be years after my kids are grown up, YouTube's done, you know whatever. That's okay. I hope I got this right. Oh my gosh. Remembered that from episode one. Memory like a champ. See that? Amazing. Hopefully we can just run through this. Let's take it to the end. It's going to be a two hour episode. Oh my gosh. That is crazy. And I will take shortcuts and, and boats on the way through so we can return faster. And elevators. Elevators as well. My goodness. Hello, home. Heading to the basement. Heading to the basement and we're... Two hours into the video game. I'm glad that I wanted to continue on with this and just keep going. I was worried that like I'd run out of coffee before the end, but I mean, there's still a little bit in there, so. I was also worried that I'd have to go to the bathroom and be like, no! Mm. I have done that a few times where like, I've been recording and then all of a sudden like, it'll hit and I'm like, I gotta go. <laughs> Wow, we made. Wow! 
That took a long time. Or are we are recording sound, right? Could you imagine if I wasn't recording sound again? Two hours without voice. Silly goose. What you doing? Uh, for those of you that didn't see it, I did record um, an entire hour episode, like 45 minutes of just silence. So, I had to make that up yesterday. Alright. Oh, this is not the boat. Hold on. Gotta go back to the boat. To boat, to boat, to boat, to boat, to boat. To boat. <laughs> this is the boat, right? Come here, boatman. No, that's the snowman. Where's the boatman? Oh, we slid. Wasn't there a hidden thing there or something? I don't remember. Oh, 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 oh. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. We gotta, gotta, oh, no, d d diagonal, no, ah, ah, whatever, <laughs> it's never good at the game anyway, we knew that, looks like a snowball, actually, it's a snow, octohedron, snowdolhedron, ha, <laughs> ha, Sands is trap, papyrus is trap, people, people, people. We actually have to get into Snowden, don't we? <laughs> so, Azrael and the first human fell in, like, they ate the... What happened there? It's actually a snow papyrus. It's a lump of snow with the word sands written on it. In red marker. <laughs> I know how to set my set myself apart now. An ear piercing... Wait. <laughs> Well, I'm glad I talked to you and didn't miss out. Oh, gosh. Okay. I didn't know we actually have to aim. Hold on. There we go. Now we're good. Did I not fall off the first time? I may not have. Okay, we don't go down there. Oh my gosh, it's going to be two hour episode. Oh. Well, you know, I hope you guys stuck around. Uh, if there's a lot of advertisements, don't freak out. Because, I mean, it's two hours versus the 30 minutes that I normally do. And if you guys didn't know the pattern, it's usually about five per, like every five minutes, throw an ad. So like five, 10, 15, 20, 25. So about five ads per 30 minutes. But two hours long, there'd be like 20 ads inside the mid-roll stuff. So care for a ride in a boat? Yes. We are going to the hot lands. Then we're off. Let's go. And Boatman, like after everybody's out, uh, you can take off. Because we won. It, the barrier's open. Tra la la. What's my name? It doesn't really matter. It does matter. I want to know your name. There we go. Come again sometime. Tra la la. I'll see you in the overworld. Oh man. Look how much faster this is going. Please select a location. Right three, please. Wow. Two hours of walking backwards and talking to everyone. And we're now back at the, the resort. 
Wow. Oh, and we for we've been forgetting to listen to <clears throat> Toriel sent you a message. This is Sand. Frisk, did you know that I love to get owned? Also, think Toriel is very good at. <laughs> Excuse me. I think Toriel just took her phone back. That's funny. Oh my gosh, look how much faster this was by using the shortcuts. Toby, thank you. Thank you for putting fast to shortcuts back to the end from the beginning. Still have 15 minutes. I don't think I'm going to fill those 15 minutes in. <clears throat> oh my gosh. We're really doing it. We're really going to the end. <sighs> this is it. Should I save right there? No, I don't need to save right there. By the way, this is the room where you battle Sans, I think. And it's supposed to be an epic battle. Oh, it's the birds again. And all the golden flowers. Is this the last save point? I think there's one more. Nope, that is the last save point. I think, no, 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 no. There's a save point right here. File saved. Okay. Now that we've talked to everyone, Frisk, do not feel left out. I have been writing messages to you as well. Um, still have my phone number after all. You still have my phone number after all this time, do you not? Sorry, I don't have time to talk, Frisk. I'm supposed to be working right now. But you aren't working. I know. It's taking all my concentration. It seems like you've really botched your quest, Frisk. But I, the Great Papyrus, will always be your friend. No matter how hard you try to get rid of him. Hey! That's true. Hey, Alfies. Alfies! Do you think we can watch something with fighting next? And then something with princesses? Or fighting princesses? Uh, I'll see what if I can manage something like that, Undyne. Yeah! On second thought, I won't write fanfic of real people. I mean, isn't real life already greatest fanfiction of all time? Uh, you didn't, didn't tell anyone I said that, because I'm going to post it online. I'm sure I'm excited about the final use of the human internet. To finally use the human internet, I bet they have all sorts of things Undyne and I can watch. Oh man! We're going to be able to watch anime online? Of course, Undyne. What do you think we've been fighting for all along? Yeah, what do you... Oops. Jinx! I knew you were going to make a joke. Wait, Alphys. I didn't know you knew Sans. Well, I... Doesn't everybody? Who the heck is Sans? Who the heck is Sans? Toriel? Wait, hey Frisk, why don't you go look for Metaton? He was here a while ago. He said he had to go somewhere. There's like a lot of different... Okay, that's the last dialogue. Frisk, I just realized, now that we aren't fighting each other, we can finally ask you, would you like to a, a cup of tea? Would you like a cup of tea? Yes. Oh! Well, actually, the cup I had is cold now, so you shouldn't have it. But I am so happy you said yes. As soon as I can, I will make some more for you, and then we can be great pals. Sounds good. Oh, Frisk, if you're not too busy, on nice days, you should walk around and have a good time. That's important. Walk around and have a good time. Okay, that's the last dialogue from her, or from him. Sorry. Tell them I said hi too. Oh, I missed what it was. Hey, Frisk, why don't you go say hi to the Napstool look? I did. I did. Frisk, why don't you take a walk around? Frisk, why don't you fly? It's faster. Yeah, Frisk, why don't you fly? 
Hmm, flying sounds a little dangerous. But they can't fly. Not with that attitude. Frisk, take a hike. Hiking is good for your bones. Oh, <laughs> funny. Sorry, I don't have time to talk. I'm supposed to be working. Okay, okay, okay. Frisk, seeing how many good friends you've made here, I'm almost certain you must have made some more. Hold on. Uh, yeah, 98,000 subscriber friends. Eee. Sorry. <laughs> Cheesy. Frisk, how about you go look around before we all go? Uh, we're, we're good. We are good. Uh, one hour and 50 minutes good, actually. So, let's save. 871 minutes and 32 seconds. Here we go. If you leave here, your adventure will really be over. Your friends will follow you out from the underground. I'm ready. This sounds like scary music, not happy music. There we are. Oh my. Isn't it beautiful, everyone? Wow. It's even better than on TV. Way better than I've ever imagined. Frisk, you live with the you live with this? <clears throat> the sunset is so nice and the air is so fresh. I really feel alive. Hey Sands. What's that giant ball? We call that the sun, my friend. That's the sun? Wowie. I can't believe I finally met the sun. I could stand here and watch this for hours. Yeah, it is beautiful, is it not? But we should really think about what comes next. Oh, uh, right. Everyone, this is the beginning of a bright new future. An era of peace between humans and monsters. Frisk, I have something to ask of you. Will you act as our ambassador to the humans? Be an ambassador? Yes. Yay, Frisk will be our be the best ambassador. And I, the great Papyrus, will be the best mascot. I'll go make a good first impression. Oh gosh. Well, someone's gotta keep him from getting into trouble. See you guys. But he went that way. Oh no. Man, do I have to do everything? Papyrus, wait! Hey, Undyne, wait up! <clears throat> Whoops. Uh, should I do something? She's still mad at him. Well, gotta go. It seems that everyone is quite eager to set off. Frisk, you came from this world, right? So you must have a place to return to, do you not? What will you do now? I want to stay with you. I have places to go. I want to stay with you. What? Frisk, you really are a funny child. If you had said that earlier, none of this would have happened. <coughs> it's, it is a good thing you took so long to change your mind. <laughs> well, I suppose if you really do have, uh, if you really do not have any other place to go, I will do my best to take care of you for as long as you need. All right, now come along. Everyone is waiting for us. <clears throat> and if she does have a family, I mean, she can always go and visit the family or do something with the family or something like that. And, you know, Undyne, er, Undertale cast. Okay. There it goes. I 
I don't know that I'm going to let this thing run all the way through its entirety because we are at like five minutes, six minutes left. Five minutes left. <laughs> Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Undertale. With me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate, a two hour finishing special. There it is! Oh my gosh, what is this? <laughs> Papyrus by Toby. It looks like, uh, what is it? Boxing. Uh, uh, Mike Tyson's Punch Out. <laughs> Special inspiration. J. N. Weedle. Mike Tyson's Punch. That was awesome. Snowdrake. The Ice Cap. Okay, yeah, I'm I'm gonna sit here for the whole thing, aren't I? Oh gosh. <laughs> that is awesome. Oh gosh. Okay. The doggo. One, 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 one. Oh, it's the dog, me and dog Drissa. I cannot pronounce their names. The lesser dog, the greater dog. We should have patted the dog until his head blew up and off the screen and stuff, but we didn't. I love pixel art stuff. Hey, the guy got out. Look, that's the, the guy, the, the thing, octopus. Oh, that's awesome. Did Alfie's just get a kiss? Nine, 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 nine. That's a portal reference. And she was breaking the concrete. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Aaron. <laughs> Timmy. Is your face falling off again? It is. It's going off to the right. Poor teams. The mad dummy. Sheeran. Well, everybody's watching. It's Braddy and Caddy watching the Metaton. Oh, they're all on stage. Change it up. There's them legs. Special inspiration. Bob Sparky, Sarah, and Jay and Weedle. Do, 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 do. Oh, yeah. We're, sti we're sticking around. Vulcan. Sunderplane. That has a crush. Finally, confessions? What? I don't. <laughs> Candle in the world of the largest birthday cakes. <laughs> Spider success. With new bakery. Use your imagination. <laughs> Final. Uh, giving life to its own meaning. A long battle finally ended. Domineering glasses seller? <laughs> Mag magic is street magician taking a wall deserve a well-deserved nap living with their families I'm glad that they they all got returned hey Asgore and monster kid always wondered like who monster kids oh they've got a school for monsters Good. It's in color now. Oh. Oh no. Ha 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 ha. It's over, Azrael. Did you really think it was over? I mean, we haven't even done the special thanks yet. Ready? Let's end all of this for good. What is this? Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Oh, gosh. This is impossible. What in the world? What? How am I supposed to avoid all those? There's there's no way to avoid that. Like, that's just... Ooh. 
Ooh. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Did I have to, like, not hit any of this to get something special? I feel, I feel like I've failed. I feel like I need to do that again. Oh, I'm not going to be able to do that again, am I? Because that was the end. The reset is over. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. I never was good at these, please! Don't make me run! Oh, I got hit. I was supposed to avoid the, the names, right? Or some, somehow? Oh gosh, this is taking much longer than I thought it was going to. Touched credits. Oh, that's that's all the ones that I touched. That really wasn't that, that much. Thanks to my friends and family for supporting us and Undertale team. Thank you, the player, from the bottom of our hearts. Without you, all of this would be impossible. Good night. Thank you everyone for watching this episode, this two hour episode special of the last of Undertale. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. I love you guys very much. Have a great night. I will talk to you very soon. Outro. Thank you.